Let's get started. First, let's talk about the dartboard and what all this means. So let's take a closer look at the dartboard. This kind of board is called a sisal board, used with steel tip darts. Usually it's referred to as a steel tip board. There are other types of boards, like electronic, also called plastic tip or soft tip, and these used soft or a plastic tip on the dart. But for this demonstration, we're gonna use the steel tip board. On the dartboard, there are 20 numbers, and they correlate with each of these 20 segments. For example, let's say you throw a dart and it lands here. This segment is worth 20 points, also known as a single 20. If your dart landed here, it would also be worth 20 points. The same rule applies for all of these large segments. If your dart goes into any of them, it's worth a single of that number. Now let's say your dart goes into this smaller segment here. This is called the double ring, and any dart that lands in this outside ring is worth double that number. Now if your dart goes here, this is called the triple ring. Similar to the double ring, if your dart lands here, it will be worth triple the points of that segment. Finally, if you hit the center of the board, or the bullseye, it has a numerical points value too. The green, or outer bowl, is called a single, and it's worth 25 points. The inner, or red bowl, commonly called a double bowl, is worth 50 points. Any dart that goes outside the double ring is outside the scoring area and counts as no score. Now, some of you may feel intimidated by the math here, but really, as you play more and more games, the repetition will help you memorize these segments until they are all as easy as a single 20, I promise. 